Hello, by Task Zero One here. Welcome back to Light Three. There's nothing else here. So much goop. It's like Shadow of the Colossus. Goop is everywhere. Whoa! I talked to it again. But it's made of lies. I can smell it. Then you think eating this could ha could open the way on, on the stairs? Even if this one isn't fully formed, but I do think it's someone's lie. I think we need to bring it out, uh, to bring out something that will solidify it from the person who lied. Plus, this lie isn't cute at all. Well. I can sympathize with you this time. Okay. That's a bit of progress. So... Aha! Like I said, isn't it you? You are flirting with the master in secret. Huh? Oh, on what basis is that? Surely she's guilty of that. I heard it. What are you saying? Don't falsely accuse me. Um, let's not fight, okay? What's this now? You're sounding the most suspicious, don't you think? That's right. You prissy goody two-shoes. What? What terrible thing to say? Prissy? And what's wrong with having both shoes? Um, excuse me. What? For your information, I do have legs, you know. That's right. I felt my ears were ringing terribly, and then all this happened. Now, as much as I want to scratch your face off, I can't. I'm so annoyed. Uh, hi? Could I... Could you tell me anything about what happened? Uh, um... There's a rumor that one of the maids is a bit more friendly with the master. Er, Master Wilbur than necessary. We got in an argument over who it was, but we can't tell. You're certain about this over-friendly maid? Yes, the rumor has seems to spread even among the other servants. But it seems no one knows for sure who it is. But it has to be you, yes? N no way! I find it very suspicious how you keep saying that. That's true. You're always being so standoffish. No doubt you're up to this or that. What did you say? What do we do? If that maid is one of them, then one of them is lying. That must mean that eyeball lie is from one of the maids. If we get guilt or regret, something like that, then maybe it'll take a definite form. Let's go one by one, hearing what these four have to say. Okay. Alright. I was expecting to get lost a little bit, but no, oh, we did it. Ha ha. I've been thinking there was something suspicious about this, but it's undeniable that it's one of these girls. Because we are all. Because we are the only ones who wear this kind of maid uniform and everyone says they saw a girl wearing this uniform calm down do you know what they were doing together <laughs> i don't know i just heard someone saw them one of these four i'll make note of that Okay, so what do you have to say? Hmm, so awful. You didn't have to speak that harshly, did you? Hey now, don't cry. Tell us what you know. Okay, uh, so I did see someone with the master once. She handed something to him. I think that's what she was doing. I th think... It was s square and white. I was watching in secret, so I don't really know 
what it was. No, that's plenty helpful. Thank you very much. Uh, you're a good person, Mr. Uh, wanna talk, uh, talk later? No, that's quite all right. Yeah. Ow! I mean, ow! What was that for, Effie? Nothing. Okay, no snack. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry! Something square and white. I'll note that. Like a memo pad? We know where that is. Effie's jealous. Like, no, that is mine. You can't have him. Why can't she just admit it? It was her already. Once we find out for sure, I'll slap her square on the cheek. It's getting more intimate with the master. <clears throat> it's getting more intimate with the master than necessary, that p punishable of a thing. Why, yes. The master is like a personal bank account if you're nice to him. Ahem. Given this, more and more people try to use him to buy expensive things. Thus, a few rules were established for the people employed here. Namely, we aren't to get too close to the master nor make any requests of him. I see. But if those rules are being broken, then that's right. One of them is secretly getting glittering jewels and other expensive things. Oh, I can't stand it. Give me some jewels, too. Thank you for your help. They made rules. Hmm. Once a culprit is found, I'll tie her up and scratch her neck. Oh, scratch your neck. I'll scratch her and kick her and have her hanged. Whoa. Have you seen your master and this maid together? No, I've only heard about it. Uh, but someone did tell me that she was a long-haired woman. A long-haired woman. There are maids... Wait, are there maids who are guys? I don't think that's relevant at the moment. Long hair, huh? Effie. Yeah, I know. That's definitely a lie. But it's still too muddled. Normally people have guilt that makes them appear as monsters. Yeah, that's right. There's always been evidence, well, proof that it was a lie. So we hear someone else's claim and confirm it with the liar. That's all it takes. You can make it take form if you know it's a lie, right? Oh, yeah! Even if the liar admits their lie, it still becomes a monster. Good. Then let's look around this floor. If we find proof that someone's telling a lie, we'll show it to them. I hate this kind of thing. Wish the fact I can see through the lies would be enough. How do you already know that there's lies, Sid? The people best at seeing through lies are usually the best at telling them. Well, whatever. Let's move. There are other things I'm curious about. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. So basically, just like we've learned before in the lore of this game between dragon, the appearance of a dragon and the and the person that they appear to is that they have they take the ability the in, the the greatest trait of that person so because leo is fantastic at lying and effie can can use that Okay, so we have to look around this floor. Okay. Let's look. Let's find a thing. Goop? Is it in the goop? Is it in the table? Is it in here? Is it somewhere here? I don't know. And you're still too muddled up. Yeah. We need to find the proof. We fought all of you. Could be back here somewhere. No. It's a 
table. Yeah, it's quite a table. Trash can, anything in the trash can? No. Anything around here at all? Wait, what? I can't go down there? That's funny. Flop! Huh. So, where do I gotta go to find this thing now? Is there a third piece? This is the only spot where there's something to actually go on. Take this one square. It sounds like a. Uh, why isn't that evidence? Ooh, trash can. Huh? It smells weird. And it's powdery. A medicine bag? Empty. I guess it was already used. It's square and white. One of the maids said that. Let's show her this. We got a medicine bag. Yay! So that was the blue hair one. Or purple hair? Yeah, purple. She added something to him. I think that was she was she was doing. There's uh, that. Show her the item. Show her the medicine bag. Ah, that must be it. I see. It was a medicine bag. The master hasn't been feeling particularly well lately. So he's uh, been having medicine. And uh, he has it before bed almost every day, I think. Who gives him this uh, medicine? Um, the master spe specified he didn't want us to know who. Spe specified the other maids can't know? Why? I'll keep looking for things to show the maids. Okay. Can we use the memo pad? Crumpled up piece of paper. Thank you again. I put it here as usual. This is some messy writing. Yeah, that's why it's all crumpled up and tossed. Seems like the master was communicating with someone. Now, if we had the other person's message, that would be nice. So... Oh wait, so those are other trash cans? Something here. Cocoa cream puffs. What do they do? Ooh, is that just a regular item? No. Yeah. Ooh, small cream puff. Cost 30, it's five. Why were there five in the trash can? I hope they're all cleaned up and wrapped or something. I don't want, I don't want, you know, bad foods. Trash can. Okay, so there's no, oh, more trash cans. Trash can, trash can, something here. Strawberry caramels. Cool. All right. Uh, I think we have what we need. So let's see, we have, But we need the other piece. Right? that other piece I checked all the trash cans I've checked everything everything but where the thing is uh, could be on the t where's the table no nothing on the table nothing here locked. I wonder if the key dropped somewhere or hidden. Yeah, it might be not too far from here. Well, there's a spot I can't reach here. Hidden 
the trash. Something shiny. Okay, get to it. Woo! Here. It's a key. Got key. Whoa, lots of made outfits. Hey, check the pockets. We start from right, from the right. Okay. Hmm, found something. Whoa, look at it. Sparkly and big. This seems to be the only one. Well, let's take this uniform. Can I wear it? No. Oh. You can take a different one. Okay. Let's show it to that maid. Got maid uniforms. That's the first one. And we're out of time once again. But we're almost there. Almost there. It shouldn't take us too long, I think. So thank you everybody for joining me. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.